Hi, welcome to my blog. Today we're going to do a Photoshop quick tip. In this quick tip, I'm going to teach you how to take a bunch of huge files and make a panorama. Notice we have 10, 21 megapixel images that we're going to combine into one file. If we try to export this in Photo Merge, it would fail. So we're going to right click, we're going to type Edit in Photoshop, and we'll merge to Photoshop as layers. Here it's bringing in layers and it's adding them into the layout. Now that all the files are in Photoshop, we'll hold down the shift key and we'll select them all then we'll select image I'm sorry edit and auto align layers here we'll select vignette and geonomic distortion and we'll pause it and come back here you can see it's aligning selected layers based on the content here you can see we've created their panorama and we need to blend it so we're going to type edit auto blend layers click it knows it's a panorama we'll click OK it'll do all the blending and we'll come right back okay you can see that it's created all of the mask layers and it's blended them all the file size is 2.14 gigs this is a huge panorama we're gonna hit zoom and zoom in let you see some of this detail this is at 60 percent we'll zoom in some more zoom get to a hundred and you can see that it was a little foggy but there's lots of detail to clean up. I exposed to the right. That's why it looks a little hoggy. Anyways, we'll use my luminosity mask tools to recreate the contrast we need to finish this panorama. But this is one huge pano. If you tried to create this file inside Lightroom and photo merge all through that plugin, it would crash the computer. So this is a way to get around that. So here's our big pano. And Again, my name's Tom Shu, and thanks for watching.